Hello my dear brothers, and my dear sisters, may God bless you all. Psalm 71 is one of the sacred poems found in the Bible's Book of Psalms, attributed to King David or an anonymous author. It is a psalm of supplication and praise, written with deep devotion and confidence in the power and mercy of God. This lyrical composition is permeated by feelings of hope, gratitude, and the search for divine protection amid the adversities of life. The poetry of this psalm reveals the psalmist's dependence on God since his youth, expressing his firm faith over the years. He cries out to God to be his rock of shelter and refuge, asking the Lord to protect him from cruel and oppressive enemies. Through unshakable trust in God, the psalmist pleads that he may never be put to shame and seeks deliverance from the clutches of the unrighteous. Psalm 71 is an ode to divine faithfulness, highlighting that God has been a companion from the mother's womb, protecting and guiding him throughout life. The psalmist recognizes that, even in the face of difficulties and persecution, his hope was always firm in God, and he declares his continued devotion to the Lord, even in old age. This psalm is a powerful message about the importance of trusting God at every stage of life. Through poetic verses, the psalmist exalts God's justice and salvation, committing himself to proclaim the wonderful acts of the Lord daily. Even without fully understanding the divine ways, the psalmist promises to praise and exalt the greatness of God, sharing his experiences and teachings with future generations. By contemplating Psalm 71, we are invited to reflect on our own relationship with God, seeking refuge in Him amid trials and giving thanks for the blessings bestowed. It is an opportunity to renew our confidence in God's love and power, just as the psalmist did throughout his journey. This psalm inspires us to persevere in faith, knowing that God is our support and support in all stages of life, regardless of the circumstances around us. Let's pray Psalm 71 and then our Father Amen. In you, Lord, I took refuge. May I never be ashamed. In your righteousness deliver and redeem me. Incline your ear to me and save me. Be thou my rock of shelter. Where you can always go. You gave the order to save me. For you are my fortress and my refuge. Deliver me, O oh my God, from the hands of the unjust. From the clutches of the oppressor and the cruel. For you are my hope, Lord. In thee from my youth have I trusted. From the maternal womb you sustain me. You brought me safely to my mother's bosom. To you I will always be consecrated. From the womb, you are my God. Do not abandon me now in old age. Do not forsake me when my strength is gone. For my enemies speak against me. Those who stalk my life conspire together. They say, God has forsaken him. Chase him and arrest him. For there is no one to deliver him. Do not depart from me, O God. Come quickly to my aid, Lord. Be humiliated and frustrated those who want to take my life. Back off embarrassed. Those who wish my downfall. But I will always wait. And I will increase your praise. My mouth will proclaim your righteousness. And your saving acts all the day. Though I cannot fully understand them. I will speak of your strength, Lord. Proclaim your righteousness only your righteousness. From my youth you taught me, O God. And to this day I declare your wonders. Now, in old age and gray hair. Do not forsake me, O God. Until I announce your power. To future generations. To all who are yet to come. Your righteousness, O God, reaches to the heavens. You, who have accomplished great deeds. Who is like you? You, who put me through. Through many sufferings and hardships. 
you will give me life again. And you will bring me up from the depths of the earth. You will increase my honor. And you will still comfort me. I, in turn, will praise you with the lyre. For thy faithfulness, O my God. I will sing praises to you with the harp. O Holy One of Israel. My tongue will exalt your righteousness. All day. For those who seek to harm me. They were humiliated and frustrated. Beloved Lord, my God and Father, at this moment, I humbly enter your sacred presence to intercede for all the sons and daughters who are part of this beloved community. Lord, I know that there are bitter, sad and afflicted hearts here, and I ask that your mighty strength and wisdom come to meet them. May your unshakable protection envelop each person subscribed to this channel, and may the enemy have no power over their lives. I especially ask for souls facing financial difficulties, deep in debt and worries. May you, O Lord, pour out your blessings upon them, removing all anguish from their hearts. Strengthen our faith, O merciful God, and may all present here find in you the hope that never fades. May this prayer be a balm to afflicted souls and a song of gratitude for your mercies. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank God. May your light shine upon us all, now and forever. Our Father, who art in heaven, blessed is your name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our debts. As we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation. But deliver us from evil. For thy kingdom and power. Honor and glory today, tomorrow, and forevermore. Amen. Glory to God. As we reach the end of Psalm 71, we are struck by the depth of the psalmist's connection to the divine. His devotion shines through in each verse, revealing an intimate and sincere relationship with God. It is as if the poetry unfolds like a song of gratitude and praise, in which the psalmist's unshakable faith manifests itself amid life's struggles and challenges. Psalm 71 teaches us about the importance of recognizing God's presence at all times, from our birth to old age. The psalmist's faith is a source of strength and comfort, enabling him to overcome adversity with courage and hope. His words inspire us to follow the example of trust and surrender to the Creator, reminding us that, in God, we find safe refuge in times of tribulation. So, at the end of Psalm 71, we are challenged to live lives marked by trust in God, gratitude, and sharing our faith with those around us. As we face the challenges of life, we can find comfort in the knowledge that God is our stronghold and safe haven. Our hope is renewed as we contemplate divine justice and wonders, allowing us to sing praises and raise our voices in worship. May Psalm 71 be an ongoing source of inspiration in our lives, reminding us of the importance of trusting God at all times and taking refuge in His unconditional love. May we live as faithful witnesses of His goodness, proclaiming His righteousness and sharing the wonders He works in us. And, above all, may our faith be a light that guides the path of others, leading them to experience the love and grace of our merciful God. Amen.